Kia ora YouTubers, my name is Dan and this video here is one of the free ones that I give away as part of my larger course. So if you are keen and you do enjoy it, uh, check out, there'll be a link in the description. Uh, but for now, let's uh, go off and look at the free stuff. Hey, my name is Dan and in this video we're going to look at uh, what Bootstrap is. Now, uh, Bootstrap is super important to know because it's uh it's how responsiveness is done through websites now there are lots of different ways of doing responsive websites but bootstrap is definitely the most popular at the moment and if you want to be a web designer uh you really need to understand and probably use bootstrap even if you don't use it you need to really understand what it is um because you're going to have clients coming in and using the word throwing it around so uh we also need to know it because dreamweaver uses it Okay, it used to use something else called Fluid Layouts, but now it uses Bootstrap. So it's kind of what we need to learn uh, when we're using Dreamweaver. Uh, it came f not that long ago. It feels, I was kind of researching and thinking, oh, you know, I'll check, uh, give them some factoids about how old Bootstrap is. And it turns out it's only like a few years old. It's kind of 2011 um, when it was kind of released. And it's gone through a couple of versions since then, but it feels like the word bootstrap, or at least Twitter bootstrap is the old word for it. It's been around for ages, but it actually is only a few years. So um, it was made by just a couple of guys there, a developer and a designer, kind of trying to make things quite simple for responsive. Now, what is bootstrap? Think of it, it's, it's called a framework. And think of it as a template. Somebody else has gone out there and created a whole bunch of things that we can use and style and build on top of, but they've done all the hard work. They've done the browser testing, the uh, uh, the bug fixing, the what happens in this browser, what happens at the screen size, all those sorts of things have been worked out by somebody else, which is brilliant for us. Um, and there are kind of like two main parts to Bootstrap. Okay, there's something called components, which are pre-made, uh, which are just pre-made bits of code that we can kind of dump on our page and use and style. And then there's something called the grid, which essentially is just the kind of like foundation or the kind of like uh, base of all the websites. But let's talk about those in two separate parts. Hey there. Remember, this video is a free extract from my course of more than 60 videos. So if you're serious about learning Dreamweaver, check out the link in below. If you like this free thing, give it a like, give it a share. I'd be really appreciative. Thanks. Hi, da da.